gentlemen, you know who this is. This is Daniel the Big O. I'm out here with the fluffy poodle. No, he said burr also. Yeah, that's right. I'm Daniel the Big O, and this is the fluffy poodle. That's right, Mr. Fluffy Bear and his aquamarine hair. You see everything. Everything is frozen out here in the bluegrass state of Kentucky. It is cold. It's frozen. It's starting to snow a little bit right now. We literally have about... 18 inches of snow dropping in the next couple days. So I'm gonna teach you guys how to prepare your pet, your dog for a major winter snowstorm. So stay tuned guys. So we jumped into the truck. We're gonna head on over to the, the pet store. We're gonna head on over to the pet store and load up on a couple supplies. So we'll see you guys there in a second, all right? So baby, don't worry. You were my only. Don't even love me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't know how to sing. No, we don't. Nah, we love to have fun. Out in the woods, on the lake, everywhere. That's right, oh. Uh -huh. And this crazy man just loves to make up his own words to every single song and it will go to the beats, that's right, even when the sky is falling down. <laughs> Let's go to the pet store, guys. So the first stop is right here in the in that toy aisle. You can't go wrong during a snowstorm to get your dog a couple of toys so they so they're a little bit active. You know when they can't go out and release that energy that they they built up on a daily basis. So either have them exercise mentally or physically. So we'll give him um, we'll get him a little toy here and go over after this. Oh, that's a good one right there. Yeah. We're gonna get you a new one of this, huh? You, you love this toy, don't you? We'll get you a brand new one. Let's go ahead and pick this one up so we can release that energy. Let's go and get some treats and also some awesome dog food. Let's see, let's see. Looks like, yep, right here. This is the one. Yep, this is the one. So we normally get him the taste of the wild Pacific stream. We, we give him the fish during the winter time because uh, the fish really helps out his coat, makes it a little bit thicker, gets him a little bit warmer. So that's a little tip, a tip and a trick for you to definitely feed some fish during winter time and then feed your other, the, 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 the regular meats, the bison, the, the deer, um, duck. There, there's many different types, but uh, feed them the other stuff during spring, summer, fall, fish during the winter. Now let's head on over to the treat section and uh, pick him up some training treats so he can definitely have a little reward during this winter, winter storm. All right. <laughs> oh, these are the ones we like, huh? Fluffy sit. You just wait one second. Um, so we normally get the Orion dog treats. Yeah, they're a little expensive, but I tell you, you can't go wrong with these treats, ladies and gentlemen. You really can't. I'm not sponsored by this this company at all. It's just something I like. I go in between this and those all natural hot dogs. So last time you had that venison fluffy. So I think this time we're either gonna get them. Yeah, let's get them this one. This one has lamb in it, ladies and gentlemen. Um, it has lamb, liver, and that tripe. Tripe is that fish, so it's also good for his coat during this winter time. That winter storm, I'm telling you, better stock up, make sure your pup's taken care of, or any of your pets at home. So we'll put back the other ones we do not need. This will last them a couple days along with those uh, all natural hot dogs that we have. So let's throw this stuff in the cart and go wait in line, guys. All right, let's, we gotta put these in the cart. Oh, I dropped it. Pick up. Fluffy, pick up. Fluffy, 
Yes, good boy, good boy. Oh, there's a long line, but it's all right. We just wait a little bit. Everybody's doing the same thing, so we'll put him in that sixth position and wait in line. Fluffy, six. For the support. Man, that store is packed, wasn't it, Fluffy and Dominic? Yeah. Look, that store is packed. Everybody is in there loaded up, getting all their stuff that they needed for their pets. Um, that, that's, that's what you do as a responsible pet owner. Just do the right thing. Make sure your pets are taken care of during winter storms. Make sure you guys have emergency rations because you really never know what could happen in an emergency. Now we'll see you guys back at the house so we can go over everything that we got. We made it back to the house. You see, we got all sorts of stuff for a winter storm weather that's gonna come in. Look, we got everything. It's gonna be easy peasy lemon squeezy to get through this winter storm. Now let's go over all those little things that uh, you need during a winter storm. We have his food. We have some toys to burn off that energy. We have some treats and I cannot stress this enough. Make sure you guys at least have a one gallon of water. Um, it, Preferably, you need about five gallons for a week, uh, but hey, at least have one ready that's not frozen or anything. Make sure you have the water ready, your food ready, some treats, and a whole bunch of toys, and we'll see you guys on the next episode. Yeah, give them a high five. All right, see you guys on the next episode.